So right now we're gonna be uh, telling some stories, making some uh, some good old pancakes, the bad boy style. Now you're gonna want to get you some fruity pebbles, some cocoa pebbles. We're gonna make it chocolatey. And then let me get some of this pancakes. I like these uh these buttermilks, the Angie Mamas. A good mix in there. You know, want some peanut butter, so we can spread it with some syrup. And then we're also going to throw in a little bit of some meat, a little cooked ham. And then we got some strawberries. So let's mix all this shit. Now while I'm doing all this cutting and hooting and hollering, I'm gonna be talking about some some very sexy stories. The strips of that. So, I remember this at one time, right? I couldn't go over there to go see this girl that I've been kissing. And uh, we playing some little games together and stuff. go back over there now what I wanted to do what I, there was enough time I was gonna be like kissing on the body and stuff like that I was always so fast-paced always having to work and I enjoy time that some things it just feels like you're so used to something And so I decided, I was like, you know what? I want to get used to something new. That time, I was thinking it's time to drop out of my vieja classes. And I thought that maybe something better should have came out of it. I thought that maybe I was cursed thinking about everything that happened. I said, maybe I just got the wrong idea. And I'm supposed to be with somebody else. I was really picturing all kinds of things. Honestly. I was like, comparing it to like, my daddy and his brother kind of things. And And I was looking at everything in different perspectives. And I didn't figure that while I was kissing on her body, thinking all this stuff. I didn't figure it out the way it did. You didn't need some milk.
so we got some milk. We're gonna throw some whipping cream. It's a regular milk. Mix that bitch around. And so, anyways, so we just like talking with her. She looks fresh. I was like, dang. Reminds me of a young thug music video. I was like, you know that who she was. She was. I think about it when I get high. She ain't got no cops. Look in your eyes and tell you that she was. Oh, my little mama, yeah, she was. There's something like that, right? Rolling around and shit. Laying down in the, in the covers. And, oh. I was like, we ain't even done nothing. People already getting all mad. All zesty and shit. And it is over and over. Sometimes overthink it. Like, what is what could be the maybes? Or babies. I was like, man. I wouldn't mind. My goodness. So this is a different girl, right? She. I think I could say that I liked her more than that. I could say that. Because the other one, man, she was mean. Now why are you talking about trying to compare me to these other dudes? Like if I'm one of them motherfuckers, it's like, oh. And then there's the other one where they did. She just didn't look at me like that. She just, she fell in love. She was just like diving in, talking about things. She made me some breakfast. I was like, oh, what is this? Oh, well, I just heated it up. That's some shit. It's the thought that fucking counts. <laughs> and so I was like, shit. All right. Mixing up some steps. Take a couple of rips from my inhaler. And then I take off. And then I come back and I was like, you know what? I really do like you a lot. And she's like, no, you don't. I said, well. I guess I don't then. And then walked out. And then I come back again. I was like, you still thinking like that? And she's like, well, I don't know. Take out. Tell me when you know, woman. So I was like, you know what? Usually I, I give women five minutes. In five minutes, I usually cut them off for the for the last three minutes. But for you, I cut it off after the last two minutes. I was like, I was like, damn. I wouldn't say I was like whooped, but I 
I say, I was like, goodness. Invited her out on a vacation. Tried to do something different. I was like, ooh. And then I went out there and bought like a bunch of gifts. Went out on the leg and the limb. At that time, I was going out there to California. I was going to go try to see my pa. And some fans out there. And then, uh. Went over there, took a look at the sights, had some Tootsie Rolls, and a big song there right there. Oh my goodness. Just that little slow cook. Who's gonna make the difference? And so, I see her again and again a couple of times. And I don't know. It don't really happen much. I call it the Sub-Zero. Where I'm just like... You know what I mean? Shit. It don't really happen much to me. And now I'm just like, ooh. Still wondering what that, that feeling was. That curiosity. Just like, was it what I thought it'd be? Or was it just something that I thought it would be? I'm not quite sure. But, these pancakes look that like they're gonna fucking taste delicious. Anyways, so bring your asses over here. Check this out. Now move that pan around, get that chicken grease all over that shit. All right. Put all that shit on there. I just pull that motherfucker up. I love to lick the bowl clean. And you know what? That got some flavor on it. Mmm. Shit. So, we want to move this shit around so that way. All that shit right there just got to there we go. We got it on pretty slow. Oh, shit. Oh, slow cook. We don't want to burn them bitches. So... we got over here back in shit. Well that's about it for right now. Let's see, let's see.
Mm. Anyway, so Like I said, my shit don't work, so. The gas is off. I'm a poor motherfucker. All right. Check it out there. I'm not looking for perfection now. music on. At least let me jam out with you. Shit. So, 
Now you can turn down the music. Anyway, I only like music. I guess it's crumble cake now. Shit. Oh, well, anyway, so yeah. So then I meet her again, right? I was like, fuck. I think there's something funky going on. I kind of figured that. She wasn't liking me too much. So I was being a fucking asshole and a dick. I was like, well, I got an asshole and I got a dick, so what seems to be the problem? She's like, yeah, but that's not you. And I said, how do you know what I am or what I'm not? She said, well, I heard. I said, well, that's your fault. Because you go by what you hear, not what you see. So, I was like, whatever. So she broke up with me. And sure, I'm a bad boy, but you know what? I know that I was a bad boy because uh, I was supposed to be the one that does all the bad stuff. So that way the other ones don't do it. And uh, it kind of worked. Unlike the oldest brother. Well, the older brother. Our oldest brother. Well, he passed away, but he came back three days later. Thought he was gone. But he ended up not being. His name is Jesus. Well, mine's just bad, boy. <laughs> I keep hearing stories at the at the school that my other little brother was trying to be a bad boy too. I was like, oh my goodness. That's no bueno. Did all this shit for nothing. It didn't work. So check it out. We're going to get this peanut butter. I'm just going to douse it all on the side of the plate. Just spread it on the plate.
Don't you go around trying to mess this up here that easily. Look, check it out. Get this. You dip it inside that peanut butter. You just slide. Mmm. Some breakfast couple pancakes. And some strawberries. And a little bit of protein meat. And a little bit of protein, so a little bit of vegetable protein. Look at that. Crumbles up. And right there, like I said, you grab a piece. Dip it into that. And just eat it like that. Oh, Alright, everybody. Well, now you know how to make some of that. That right there is some good stuff, so go ahead and eat it up because you know that love and peace is all we eat. Yum.